Ethan, are you all right? I couldn't do it. I was supposed to kill him to save Sean. And I couldn't do it. You're not the origami killer, Ethan. You're not responsible for those murders. I can prove it. That changes nothing. Saving Sean is all that matters now. I can't. Not now. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Anyway, I am. Um, I'm. I'm gonna go. I've no more business here. I'm going home. I hope he proves his innocence. He finds his son alive. He's trying to save his son. He's being chased by the police, and I'm... I'm trying to kiss him. What an idiot. What was I thinking? How could I have ever believed that he... felt something for me? They're looking for Ethan. It looks like a raid. It's all over for Ethan. Keep out of this, Madison. Just, just get on your bike and take off. There must be some way of warning Ethan. Think, girl, think. Too late to go back to the room. The police are already coming up the stairs. Too late. Ethan's gonna get arrested and he won't be able to save his son. I'm sorry, Ethan. I'm so sorry. Gotta get some pictures. I'm the only journalist around. It's the scoop of a lifetime. I've got to warn Ethan. What's going on? Isn't this great? Like being in a TV show. Who'd have thought it? The origami killer renting a room here registered under a false name, but I recognized his face. Come on, what was the damn number? Come on, come on! Pick up the phone! Hello? 
The cops. They're in the motel. You've got to get out of here. Lord? I'm sorry, Scott. You should have listened to me, Mr. Shelby. I told you to drop the investigation. Your son is a serial killer. How many people does he have to kill before you turn him in? Gordy has his faults, but he's still my son. You have no children, Mr. Shelby. You can't possibly understand. You leave me no choice. Your investigation is over. For good. Find a way to cut it fast. Lauren! 
Lauren, wake up! She's lost consciousness. I try to burn the ropes if I could just reach the cigarette lighter. The clock! It's usually glass in these old cars. Just maybe. I was going to take up swimming again. This isn't exactly what I had in mind. You got a car back at your place? Mine's obviously pretty fucked up. Yeah, sure. What are you going to do? I'm going to go settle a few scores. Come on, I'll take you home. I'll block your doors and windows and don't let anybody in but me. Okay? Be careful, Scott. I don't want to lose you.